What's going on YouTube? 50s Viking here, or 50s Viking here, back again once again for another episode of The Threshold's Soul or Randomized Soul Lock of Pokemon Zeta and Omicron. And of course I can't do a soul lock by myself, so I am joined once again by Mr. Corwin. Say hello, Mr. Corwin. Hello, what's going on? Alright, so last time we ended up picking up eggs here from uh egg guy uh, we decided not to run around and do a little bit of hatching we're gonna kind of let it happen organically hopefully the eggs hatch at the same time but I have no idea my, uh, my so, summary says it's not gonna hatch soon no of course it's not you just picked it up well I walked like 10 steps but well we've got a lot to kind of explore in this town and find out what's going on I, I wouldn't mind seeing if we can find another encounter uh, apparently, Team Asgard or Olympus is here, uh, depending on whose version you're following it a bit more. I found a Ooh, lot if of we go, them. if we go north, uh, we uh, or out of the city, we actually get to Route 306, which would be a new encounter. So you should do this up because it's totally you first this time. Yeah, I'm just trying to get my pen to work here because that's important. All right, so I'm going to jump to the grass here and see what my encounter is. If I get an encounter... I can't stand the suspense. Alright, so my encounter for Route 306 is... Oh. Another normal type, being Cincino, but I love this mon! Ah, uh, that's awesome. I got, I got a male Dugon. <laughs> Well, that is a pair. So, what is with us in the water in normal types? Is this water first or is it ice first? Uh, I believe it is water. I think it wouldn't matter because we'd have to give up our our original pairing anyway. I, I'm being told it is water typing first. Part of the threshold's technical team standing <laughs> on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Believe it or uh, not, um, Threshold is filmed in front of a live studio audience. <laughs> well, on your side. Oh, yeah. yes. Lower. Oh, my attack and defense. That's not good. I really want this Cincino. I'm true. I'm super hard not to accidentally lose any more pairs for us. Oh, Lord. Oh, no. What? I almost lost time. Jesus, don't do that to me. This Encino knows tail slap. Oh my god. I've, I've got to switch out. You gotta. I, I can't take the risk of... Oh. Even if it hits fuzzy five times, like, that's that that's fuzzy gone. I'm going for a Pokeball. Let's, let's go, let's go. You know what, I'm just gonna throw a ball at it and hope for the best. Go uh, great ball. Got out. I'm so glad I scooped up these great balls. That's right, your encore does nothing when I throw a Pokeball. It keeps lowering my defense. You know, I'm gonna take this turn to actually uh, heal up time in case I have to switch out again. Super potion to get him back up. Oh, tail slap! Oh my god! Critical hit! Oh no. Three. Oh. This is not going well. I can't take the chance if it hit me with anything. I'm. I've got to use a super potion. Uh, it keeps lowering my defense. I've got, I've got to switch back. You have to. Hoping time to, takes doesn't take a tail slap. I'm, I'm like watching your screen. You've got me on the edge of my seat here. It's just like, oh no, am I losing a mod? But we know it doesn't have technician. It doesn't have technician. <laughs> That's. <laughs> or sorry, it doesn't have skill link because it's not hitting me five times guaranteed. <laughs> That's true. 
So I'm less excited about the Cincino. God damn it, Dugong, get in the damn Pokeball. I'm running the same problem. I've, I've got to hit it again. Oh, it keeps using Tickle. <laughs> tickle. Of all moves to devastate my team with. <laughs> tickle. Alright, Zincino's in the yellow now. Hopefully this great ball will do something. The capture rate in this can't be too high. I caught the Dugon. Congratulations. Ah! Oh. I've got to switch again. I'm so glad that switching mods resets all of the stat drops. I don't know if I can catch this, because I, I can't hit it with Fuzzy. Just keep throwing balls at it. I wish I was better at thinking up names. Well, you caught the Dugon? Yeah. Nice and Sea Dog. Ah, uh, Sea Dog, there we go. Yeah, because. Oh. That tail slap is so devastating. You can do it. Where'd my 5 alive go? There it is. You're going to have to bleep that out, by the way. Bleep what out? The brand of beverage you're drinking. We can't mention brand names. Oh, okay. By the way, everyone uh, who understands YouTube use uh, or terms of use and conditions, leave a like and and a comment down below. Yeah, I'm shamelessly plugging comments. That happens. Can you risk another hit? Like no, I've got, I've got, well, after that tickle, no, I've got to switch back out to time. I mean, can you risk hitting this Encino again? I can hit it with time, I cannot hit it with Fuzzy. Um, in between episodes, by the way, I went back to the uh, guy with the IV stones, and I had actually thrown max attack IVs onto, uh, onto Fuzzy, so now I can't take the chance of hitting anything that I want to catch. Helping which, hand. I know, I want this thing! So bad. There you go, you got it in the red now. I have already thrown five Great Ball, this is Great Ball number six. And uh, one Pokeball at this thing. Oh my god, stay in the ball! <laughs> sing! What? It's got Sing. Uh, I've... I don't... I don't know if I can risk catching this, because I might lose them on over this. You got this. God. Oh. Here, guy, don't switch out. Go for the bag. Go for the Pokeball. That's a lot of great balls on a um, pairing we can't use. And now I've got a switch. <laughs> you know what? I'm I'm gonna risk staying in. Use my last great ball here. Yes! Yes! Ah, yes! Oh, sweet. Um... You know what, I didn't actually have a nickname for my Sencinos whenever I was using them. Popcorn. I like it. Alright, so I'm gonna head right back to the Pokemon Center and deposit that thing. That was... Oh, my heart. Deposit this, heal up my Mons.
Look at all the mons we have in the PC here, Cory. This is five pairings we can't use. <laughs> I know. Power in the PC stone, though. Power in the oh wow, uh, Adino's holding an orange berry, and the Cincino or popcorn is holding a Chesto berry. I see a cave behind this big Pokemon Center, too. Really? Yep. Well, I'm just talking to the people in the Pokemon Center. Well, I want to... Before you go into the cave, let's run around town, talk to some of the NPCs, see if anyone has anything useful for us. Because there's a lot of houses in this town. Alright, so... I really want to find out where that, um... That randomized house is. Do you like Pokemon? Yes. Ooh, Zangoose or Sir Viper? Sir Viper? I, I do like Sir Viper more. I just got a Zangoose. What? Yep. Where are you? The house next to the mart. Wait, wait. I just have, I just obtained a Bonsley. From where? The house in the bottom right hand corner. Uh, male or female? Uh, it doesn't matter. These are these are apparently static pairs. Well, are these the same? Like, are we getting handed two Pokemon into this city? We're gonna have to figure this out. All right. Well, I'm calling my Zangus Ferret. I'm calling my Bonsley Apple. All right. Uh, where was the house again that you went to? Bottom right hand corner. Right hand. Uh, this one. No, bottom right hand corner. This one. I totally know my left from my right, by the way. This house? No. <gasps> That's a shiny Voltorb. Alright, I'm gonna have to talk to this guy. I need to find out what house you're in. Like, uh, this house here? Yeah, that one right up there. That white one right there, yeah. All right. Well, talk to the little girl. This one? Yep. Oh my god. So, um Bonsley and Bonsley is is a is a pairing because it, they are static mons. There's not really much we can do to stop that. Um I spelt the name wrong, but okay. I was gonna call it Fossil, so whenever we get a name renamer, uh, or name raider, I'm gonna change that. Okay, so where did you get that Zangoose? The one next? The house to the left of the po or of the mark. Uh, so I chose Surviper, so you should choose Zangoose. I have a Surviper. Right. So that is Sir Viper and Zangus. Not a pair we can use. What is with us in normal? Because we have that. Like that's what's preventing us from using a lot of pairs is the fact that we have a lot of Pokemon that are normal. Type. So it's starting to look like we should. Um, we should wait to go into houses. Wait a minute. Now, we can both use Bonsley. How so? Uh, it's a static pair. We have no control over the typing, so we can use it. 
Same thing with the uh, Surviper and Zangoose, right? Well, except for yeah, the but, normal typing. But that's, right? no, that's normal poison. Like, that's a typing we already have. But we can actually use the Bomb Slate. Nice. Um, so, we're going to look at using the Bomb Slate for the next couple of episodes. If anyone has a problem with that, feel free to leave a comment down in the comment section below. It took me a second to think of it. Um... But uh, as they are static bonds, we have no control over their typing or what they can do. Uh, I really don't. It falls within all of the rulings. So I'm going to deposit my Zangoose here. Or Ferret. I really like that it has immunity too. I'm going to... I don't really need to heal my mons, but let's take a look at a few more of these houses. These houses have been awesome in this the one, town so the far. The one straight below you, go in there, and I'm, I'm now battling that horsey in the top left-hand corner. Well, that's, yours is a magmar. You're battling the horsey? Well, it's it, it turned into a beautiful butterfree once the battle started, but yeah. I just found a lumberry on the beautifly. Sure, I'll attack the Magby. Why not attack the baby Tithead? It's a Krabby! Well, kind of glad I'm leading with time right now. Whoop! Well, I I did it! I defeated the Krabby! Yay, I got a Moonstone. Oh, that's... What? What? That's outside. It's outside? The one you picked up earlier. Oh, okay. I want to check this house with the green. Oh, apparently the gym leader is a steel-type robot. Yeah, I heard that. That's different. I do like robots. Uh, there's a chef in a building that seems to be able to change nature. Would you like are it to you, be... It changes it to adamant. Are, are you fluffy kitten me right now? I am not fluffy kitten you right now. I need this person because I need all of the adamant nature on on fuzzy. Um, well, the big-ass Pokemon Center in the middle of town, it's just to the left of that. Oh, wow, there is a giant Pokemon Center. It's to the left, not right. You're really bad with your left and right. I, I, I have problems. <laughs> so I, I can actually switch my Mon's nature? Yeah, top right hand corner guy. I want to talk to everyone else first. Oh, wait to talk to the useful guy. Now you said um, north there was a cave as well. It's actually in the middle of town, to the right of that, I believe. That that Pokemon Center. Yeah, it's right to the north east of that Pokemon Center. So um, I have my Bonsley in my party. Do you still tote yours around? I am toting apples around. Yep. Uh, see, I went to name mine fossils and misspelled it, and everything went wrong. Appears to be an I young trainer, please can you can't leave us. We need you to stop Team Olympus from taking over Pokey Haldron Calder. Okay. So we can't leave here. I can teach one of your Pokemon uproar. Yeah. That's in the ex Blood house. I really don't want one of my mons to learn uproar right now. That's what I thought. Although um I may turn to Ursarang when we're done here. Alright, this house I haven't been in yet. Cool. I, um, joined the police club. By the way, everybody, I'm not singing that. Alright, so... 
So you said north was where you found the cave? Northeast of that big ass Pokemon Center. So onto the route then? No. Oh, okay. It's literally right to the northeast of the Pokemon Center, right off the back corner. Oh, okay, yeah. Alright, well, do you want to... Uh, this is your encounter. Wait. Is this... Is this where we came out of? Yeah, this is where we came out of. Okay. okay, okay. We're not stupid. So, we need to defeat the Team Rocket guys, I guess. Well, I want to go up north on the path here, see what's going on up here. Because it won't allow us to go south. Yeah, I know. So I'm going to switch Fossil... ...to the lead. Yeah, it's a little bit of experience that never hurt. North we go. Would fishing give us another encounter? No. No, because we've already gotten the encounter for this route. Uh, I'm going to go up the, uh, the left side here, because there's two people there. And I don't want to battle two people. Double uh battles... Not what I want. Oh, Jirachi! I love Jirachi! I went to the right, too. Well, the guy on the left had a Jirachi for me. I'm kind of glad that. Oh, no. Okay, Fuzzy does have a fighting game. Although, Jirachi is steel psychic, so it's not going to be super effective, but it's going to do something. <gasps> I know Fink attack. And Jirachi knows Swift. That did a lot of damage. Because that was a crit. And Jirachi used rest. Awesome. How come my battles seem to stall out longer than yours? I don't know. Yeah, that should take care of Jirachi. Should be nice experience for Fossil, though. Yeah! 1572. Level 7, level 8. Learned low kick, level 9, level 10. Level 11. Hey, Fuzzy grew to level 24! And I'm really enjoying doing this playthrough with this Urserang. I never really got a chance to play through it since Heart Gold. Oh. I talked to a fisherman and now I'm in another battle. After this battle, I'm going to have to check the egg summary to see how close my egg is to hatching. Probably not too, too close, uh, but it never hurts to check in every now and then. So how are things going over on your side there, Mr. Corwin? Uh, not bad. Still battling these, uh... Your double battle? Yeah. Oh, this Banfu is set up to meditate. Okay. Oh, I needed that crit. Alright, Fossil grew to level 12 and is trying to learn Rock Throw. I think I can forget Flail. But to use, oh, I did not pay attention to what mon that was. I'm going to send it fossil anyway to do my switch trading with it. And that is a Durant. You know what? Competitive Durant is actually a thing. Really? Oh, yeah. Home Claws Durant with weakness policy just eats through stuff. Oh, you haven't faced my new team, you wouldn't know about that.
Actually, Mr. Gorn, that's something we have to do soon. I have to have another Pokemon battle with you. It's been a little while since we've had a battle. That is true. No, not like you'll win. Mind you, again, we seem to be the weirdestly in sync people for double battling. This route goes a long ways with these battles. What do you mean? I'm just kind of, kind of sneaking past all these people, and there's a lot of walkways of people. I don't know. Uh, I'm in a battle right now. Looks like it may be a double battle. Yep. Rufflet and Metatite. And definitely getting Fossil Eddie. Uh, yeah, I can't. No, no. Fossil's going to fight. Hopefully this just go horribly wrong for me. That's a fury attack. Stop it! Stop! Ow! Why does everything no meditate? I'll take that rufflet. Uh-oh. What did you do? Oh my god, thank god. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! So that means you can no longer use your chandelure. I'm really sorry for that. I really should not have risked staying in for the rufflet. I can't. I can't believe I just did that. The worst thing is, is we don't have a pair to switch them with. That's just a lost pair. Yep. Uh, so we've seen the first bit of heartbreak here in the channel. Um, goodbye time. You will be missed. That also means that We've got to run back to the Pokemon Center. No, we just keep going, just don't use them. I can't believe that that just happened. Actually, that's time in the episode there, James. So, I guess on that bombshell... I can't believe this. Yeah, just let me get out of this battle. At least Fuzzy's still putting in lots of work. Alright, so on a sad note, that's all the time we have for the episode today. Um, thank you for joining us here, uh, and we will see you next time at The, the Threshold. Threshold.